Well, despite the low risk of getting the coronavirus, many people are stockpiling supplies. So items such as bottled water, canned goods and paper products, they are flying off the shelves and some stores are now limiting the amount that people can buy. 13 investigative reporter Joe Bartels is live near MLK in the 95 to help explain the science behind exactly what is going on here, Joe. Well, Todd and Trisha, big box stores, grocery stores and warehouse clubs like Costco have been swamped with shoppers trying to snatch up whatever they can to prepare for whatever happens next. Scenes like this are playing out across the country and in Las Vegas. Shoppers stockpiling and preparing for what if scenarios. I think that to a certain degree, there's a sense of panic. Dr. David Jenis is the clinical director for Southern Hills Hospital. He says before anyone hits the stores for panic induced buying, take a deep breath. Literally, it can reduce stress and help you think more clearly. When individuals have this belief or, or this perception that there's um, an imminent threat of, of something uh, challenging or, or horrible to happen, uh, that can certainly influence one's behavior and responding um, in a certain way that's maybe a little outside of character. The coronavirus is still top of mind. Southern Hills Hospital, like others in Clark County, have advanced screening procedures in place before anyone can walk into a hospital. Despite the extra precautions, health authorities say the risk of catching coronavirus is still low. At this point, there's no real danger to going out and living your life as you normally do. The things you want to think about are increasing hand washing, and increasing how often you sanitize your hands when you're not able to get to a, a sink and wash your hands. Dr. Amy Stone is an assistant professor at Toro University. She says the virus is from a family of bugs associated with the common cold. It's passed from person to person through close contact and ingesting droplets from an infected person. And stockpiling bottled water is not going to prevent the spread. All of our city water is going to be safe the virus is not spread through water. And so having extra bottled water is not going to change your risk of infection, which is still very low. Joe Bartels, 13 Action News.